Rolling guys, welcome back to another vlog and today I'm going to Crew Alexandra versus Warsaw. We're away from home again, you know, I think this is our fourth away game in five in five games this season so far. So I've done a bit of travelling but it's a nice local one to crew today. Um, we're taking another thousand which is brilliant support from the Saddlers fans. Hopefully we can come away around five o'clock today with some free points because we've really struggled this year on the road. I think we've only got one away win in 2023 and that came in the FA Cup. So we're still looking for our first away win in the league in 2023. We've got to do a lot better away from home if we want to be, you know, even in that top half. Because, you know, that's letting us down at the moment. And we're not starting games in the right manner. You know, we've got to be at it from the first whistle. We're not, we haven't been this season so far. You know, look at Wrexham. In the Wrexham games conceded two goals in 20 minutes looking shaky defensively. Um, it's at Stockport 2 at home we were not at it in the first 20 minutes and they'll punish your teams good, good sides punish you and when you're not at it so we've got to start from the first whistle today if you want to get anything out of the game crew have got off to a good start this season one win two draws sitting in the, in the top seven so we had a decent start from crew we've got some good players you know they always you know I said in my last vlog in April against crew they always bring through the academy players which is always good to see some people also Hopefully can do a bit more of, you know, we've got Joe Fawkes who's been starting, but hopefully he can be a regular because I've been impressed with him so far. Hopefully introduce Ram back into the squad today. Um, my score prediction, surely Wolves will get our first league away win of 2023, um, but Crew won't be, you know, an easy game. So um, I'm going to back Walsall. I'm always optimistic in my score predictions. I'm going to go over 2-1 win to Walsall. I'm going to go with Freddie Draper and Danny Johnson to get the goals today. And hopefully we can get um, three points today. So I'll see you at the ground. Come on, you saddlers. Grandad, another away game. We've got crew away. What are we thinking? Hi, Saddler fans. MJB here. <clears throat> Disappointing on Tuesday night. I thought that we'd beat Wrexham. I thought there was going to be the, the first away point. Very poor performance. Bad defending. So, uh, I don't know. I think we need a, somebody else in the defence besides what we have got. And anyway, it's on to crew today. They ain't lost the game. They've won two, drawed, drawed one, another tough game. So, let's hope the Saddlers can bring the points home. And let's start and get some points on the board. Of course, we're going to get running away from it. People are getting, getting all the points and we're getting none. We've got to get out on it. So, come on, Saddlers. Book your ideas up and get three points. And I say, ooh, 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 far away, far away, Saddler's over now. Come on, Saddler's, bring the three points back today. Oh, 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 oh. Oh! 
Yes.
Ci vuoi il polo mosso pack? Fa fa we! Fa we! Fa we! Il mosso boys fly away won't be for we! Goal. Feels like a defeat that. So yeah guys, Walsall have conceded in the 95th minute to Crew Alexandria to draw 2-2. Two -two. Feels like a defeat, defeat like I said it, um, full time, you know. To come that close to winning and to throw it away, it's just such a Walsall thing to do. And that continues our run without a win um, away from home in the league since um, Boxing Day last year um, when we beat Swindon 2-1. So yeah, it's not good enough for our away record. But I thought we played quite well today, especially first half. I thought we were outstanding really. Deserved them two goals, Freddie Draper, Isaac Hutchinson getting them two good goals. Um, and we've come out of the trap second half really well as well. We've had some really good chances in there. We could have made it 3 or 4 nil, but killed the game off really. Um, but the subs just let us down again, tactically from Matt Sadler, I do question it, the subs. Um, there's no need to change the front two, um, and we did, and it's just affected the game. Jamil Matt offers nothing up front. You know, we don't win a header, he doesn't hold the ball up, um, he's got no pace, he doesn't work hard, so yeah, we're playing we're playing with 10 men really, unfortunately, to say that, um, when, we, when he's on the pitch. Um, it's not um, not good enough that to throw it away. You know, good teams manage to grind out results um, away from home. Um, we haven't done it. We've conceded in injury time in the last uh, uh, the last four games in the league three times. That's got to be sorted really if we want to be up there this season. Uh, man of the match, I'd give it always, um, either Isaac Hutchinson or Ross Tierney. Stirk had another good game as well. Um, I thought Hussey and Gordon. And put a shift in as well. Also, Draper up top was outstanding. So, performance wise, individually, I thought it were good. And there were good signs of a good performance in there. Just to throw it away last minute feels like a defeat. So, yeah. Um, we've got um, Brighton in the Papa John's Trophy on Tuesday. I'm not too sure if I'm going to that one yet. And then we've got Grimsby at home next Saturday. So, I'll see you for that vlog. So, yeah. Thank you guys for watching this vlog. And up the Saddlers.